Sun Language Resource Center, Baker, and I'm happy to welcome you one more time. And today, I want us to talk about uh, uh, childhood games, the games that we used to uh, play when we were young in the villages or in the estates or even in the residential flats if you were brought up in a flat but I know many of us watching this video were either brought up in an estate within our town setup or in the village deep 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 in the village where civilization was not there it came far much later in the years or maybe still you're in that village where nothing much has changed it happens this is kenya and it is true there are some areas which are abandoned so to say and they've been forgotten those who've been brought up in town and used to live in estates i don't know if you remember irengari fili any kuna cinema as certain vehicle pushes uh, something that the hide a generator and then they had what we we call a sign is it a sign <coughs> A sign, C I N E, sign film, cinema, ikuina zunguka, that we to it to Nazunguka, Nazunguka, a twangina na itanga, watatoka any chini, because that's what we used to hear. You could hear guys in Dika, because uh, I think I attended some Dika TODC uh, gardens there. And you could just hear, Ototo, Kaini Chini. And before you could sit down, don't mind the do the man. <laughs> before you could sense what is happening, you've been hit by a storm. And sometimes even the bad eggs, rotten eggs could be thrown. I don't know where they, they, those guys used to get them. But it used to happen. And then uh, the film is started. You watch most of uh, films that we could not understand. You just stay there watching horses running, wazungu. Finally, you are done. And you go home, happy that you are watching a, a film at the Nema. <laughs> Besides that, we used to do hide and seek at uh, Ofafa uh, with some guys there. Akina Chacha, Akina Jose, Akina Jogo, Mofa, those guys. We used to do hide and seek. Kades, Kades uh, arrested. Sometimes back at this, uh, it's good to remember you. And you guys, we used to do childhood games. We could uh, crisscross at Jakagiri PCEA church. We, can, we could cross uh, uh, Muslim primary school to Majengo, Biafla, Pirate, all over. But um, yeah, I was not brought up in the town, by the way. Our Kwanga to my best. Walikuwa na nivuruta na kuja dhika. Naona maisha ya city zenye ilikuwa. Kwa tulikuwa, tunaenda pare dhika arcade. Dhika arcade ya kukuwa na arcade by the way. Kulikuwa stage ya kuanda kwetu na kwenda na robi. Kulikuwa na eucarectors, trees. Mefao, mira ihu. Yari hau. And uh, at Mark first there was a shop where they used to sell sondas and creamed cakes. That's where we could go when we are going to Sharks to wait for us to take us back to the village where I was born. I went there, primary school there, high school there. God is good. There was no courage 
in that village. So I moved out to the car. <laughs> then I said that I want us to reflect on our childhood games. And the reason I'm doing this, I believe many people know that I major and I talk much about the deaf people and sign language. Back in the village, there are those childhood games and songs and dances. Some we did as the moon lit our compound and some stories we could share in the house when uh, the house was only lit by either a kerosene lamp Inawaka. Na mafuta kerosene used to be not so expensive. It was not expensive, it was a bit cheap. I remember when I could come to the car, I could be sent with a jerry can, five liter jerry can, to buy some kerosene. And I remember I used to pay 25 bob at Shell petrol station. Vika or Catex, uh, petrol station Vika town. And with the 25 bob, I could carry the 25 liter jerry can home. Until one day, I went home with the jerry can half empty. Why? Because, don't worry about the duty men. I'm on the street, so don't you worry. They'll come and go. A certain guy, Father uh, Mukereti. By then, Mukereti was full of people, business people, clothes, mtush, kwa imejapo, kwa rauda, faka, kwa doctor washira, kwa kulikuwa, kuna manyumba. And as I was walking around that path with 300 shillings which I was given for some family matters, <laughs> I met a guy, some guys there, and they were doing the pata potea thing, I hope you know it. Niki weka hi ni changani ni changani ni changani ni gani inakura kitambo usema ni gani nataka kuonyesha nimekwambia hii ndio inakula naweka hii haikuri na niki na nikiberiti inaonyesha uh, match stick ziko ndani hii haikuri na hii haikuri and it's not winning any money this one is the one which is winning and if you want to win more money and then the guy did my 200 uh, shillings like this Jew. Kijana to Mia Macho, and my 200 went away. So I was left with 100 to take home and to buy kerosene. <laughs> and that's when I went home with half jerkan of kerosene. And by the way, the guy who was doing that pata patel, I still see him in Dika, even today. With a, we are pushing a cart on Kokoteni. Sometimes I think, I think I should ask him for that money. Or should, what should I do? I think you can uh, inbox me. You can write that on the comment section. Whether I should ask him to repay me back my money. Or I just forget it. You can carry it and carry it. But that's a story for another day. So in the village, during the day we could play games. <laughs> I remember my brother used to come in, uh, from school and could sing some songs, very fun ones. And he also used to sing and do stories which were very funny and enjoyable by, uh, by the way for that matter. Dera dire na ro oro, dera kora duru e komie, dera mera duru o kera, jora gamale toro ewa, ewa, na yo duru e vera jera, abo tige ko jora ga, go yo horo a tuari, tuari gere nyama jera, nere mo kodewa kahio ewa, ewa. 
<laughs> some very funny songs. Then in the evening, we could sing songs, dances, and dancing like Watata Watereri. Have you heard of that? Watata Watereri. Watata Watereri, nyobai tone jega. And then the other guys would respond and sing. Watata Watereri, de gesi da ito. Then the other team says, Watata Watereri, ito ne ya ihiga. Then they said, Tito, we want one person from you. And then we could chase aloud and enjoy. And then they run. You learn. If you are caught during the racing, then you shift from your sausage house and you, or family, and then you move to their family. They continue building their family. If they are not able to uh, catch you up, then you are move back to your Enjoyable games. Nyoba ya mwari mwito mwenye nyo mwenye nyo Nyoba ya mwari mwito mwenye nyo mwenye nyo That time when you sing that kaka thing you are holding on the shoulders of each other and then uh, you are Moving like this, nyopa, mwari movito, mwenye nyo, mwenye nyo. And uh, I think that it used to be awesome. We could also do hide and seek. Uh, hide and seek was also a game during the day. You hide, some guys come looking for you. Why am I giving all, you all these stories? Because I am wondering where do the deaf children play? Where do they get their entertainment? When your children are doing hide and seek in the, uh, along the streets in the estates, and when they are doing nyomba yamari mweto mwenyenyo mwenyenyo like this in the villages, where is a deaf child. You used to do so many things together as children, even reading storybooks like Magana Ive. Magana Moi, Magana Ive, Yoko Yoro, Otire, Hara, and you. Magana Ive. We used to share those stories. When we are sharing such stories, where is the deaf child. When we are singing the traditional songs and dances and we dance, we dance, we dance, we enjoy, where is the deaf child? When we are saying, Kogoro Kogoro Kore Konene, Shega Shega Rehe Itete, where is the deaf child? Child. Where is the deaf child? Who does stories for the deaf child? Who writes and publishes short stories for the deaf child? KICD, where are the deaf stories for the deaf child? Hmm. Where are the, the picture stories that a deaf child can watch and enjoy and understand? Where is it? Kenya! The world all over. Where is the deaf child? I'm asking. Where is the deaf child? Where is the deaf child? When other children are being entertained, when they are watching films, when they are watching a certain movies, on, even on uh, TV, where is the deaf child? I think uh, that's enough questions for today. And I want to ask all of us, those who are musicians who sing, 
those who are dancers, those who are models, the media personalities, people in authority and in government, keep asking yourself, where is the deaf child? 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 In all that we are doing today, where is the deaf child? So I wish that you may take up the challenge. Even in our churches, in Sunday school, wherever we could be, where is that deaf child? Can they be able, by the way, can they get space in your church? Can the deaf child get space in your organization? Can the deaf child get a space in your school? Can the deaf child get space in our government? Can the deaf child get a space in Kenya? Can they? Can they?